back everybody this is bold by 89 and the game i'm playing is the long dark this is episode three <clears throat> if you missed number two um i'll have a link in the description down below to it um and number one was also a uh train wreck because i got really hurt 10 seconds in so here we are uh last time we found a cabin got a whole bunch of stuff uh, found this train wreck, got a little more loot, and now we are going to leave Mystery Lake. For wider pastures. Because there's no green. Because it's all snow. Welcome back. I know I already said that, and I appreciate you being here for uh, episode 3. Maybe we can get into a little trouble. Hopefully find a gun. Can I find a gun? I can hunt a deer and have meat for days. Uh oh. My batteries are dying in my controller. Um, I don't necessarily remember these areas all too terribly well. I remember that first one because uh, when the game first came out, that's the that was the only level. Um, but this one, I'm so sure. I think I'm just gonna keep following train tracks. Maybe I'll come across another house. Um, bear with me while I'm not walking. I'm going to switch my battery so that um, in the middle of a fight with a wolf or bear I don't get mold. Alright, that was painless, right? Quick, easy, painless. We're just gonna keep on heading this way. Oh no, I know where I am now. I got here in the story mode. And the bear attacked me. Let's eat some jerky. Drink a little water. See if it will matter if I throw that on. For sure. That's so why you can't feel your dang hands. You don't have any gloves, you fool. Those are definitely not warmer than my beanie that I'm currently wearing. So yeah, I just trekked all the way across this field. Finally got a gun. Tracked all the way back to that cabin that I was just at in the last episode. Halfway there, a bear came out of nowhere, chewed on the face, and I almost died. And when a bear chews on your face, uh, there is a random chance that you drop your rifle. So I dropped it. Didn't know. Kept walking, walked all the way back, half dead, blinded, dying, bleeding. Got all the way back to that cabin, opened my inventory, and realized that I no longer had a gun. And I'm not sure if they patched it since then, but the mission was to hunt an animal with a rifle, and I didn't have a rifle, so I'm stuck.
Yeah, it's a long, sad story of my inevitability to survive in the Canadian wilderness. You can make something with this. Yeah. Fire. I already have wool in this kitchen. Gosh, another rifle? Another rifle cartridge. This stuff will come in handy. Ooh, that one's 98%. That one might actually be better than the one I'm currently wearing. Take coal, because that burns forever. Yes, got some gloves. I mean, they're not the best gloves. This barrel right here saved my butt when I was dying from that bear. Hunkered down in there because I don't think the bear could get me in there. I scrounged up enough to make a fire, healed myself, and I ran all the way back. This idiot me tried to fight the dang bear, you know? But I ain't playing with no bear this time. I'm just gonna go straight on the train tracks. At the end of these train tracks, there should be a new area for us to explore. See, the thing with this game is there's, in this mode, there's no other people. And it's kind of creepy, as you expect there to be. And since all the updates, I mean, it just had an update the other day. With all the updates, could be. I have no idea. But it's so eerie. Like, I can't see anything. I have no idea what's around me right now. It just feels like there could be, like, a monster out there. A dragon or something. Uh, but I'm pretty sure the, the worst things are bears and wolves. Um, but, you know. This gives you that creepy vibe. It's so quiet. So desolate. Another thing is you can fall in this ice. Oh my gosh. That was a pain in my butt also. So once you fall in, you get wet. And once you're wet, you freeze. If you're enjoying uh, the survival, uh, let me know. I have other survival S games. I could play um, Ark or um, Minecraft. Uh, we, me and my son were playing uh, Minecraft Survival in a, uh, two videos on my channel, two videos on his channel. If you want to go check them out, uh, I'll leave a link in the description down below also. Um, He'll be making more videos soon. Just need to close my eyes. No, you don't. You're not closing nothing. You're gonna keep walking. You die, I die. You die, I die. You die, I die. And we ain't dying, son. We ain't dying. We're too strong. You can't see me, but I totally had my teeth clenched because I was almost positive my guy was going to break his damn legs. i take one of those. My pack is extremely heavy at the moment, but... I mean, I just got to to really be doing great at this game we need to find a pry bar and a gun
Those are my two wants right now in this game. Pry bar, we can open up just about locker, any lockers, anything locked. Basically, we can pry open. Um, let's do it. Uh, we can pry open any lock things, and then the rifle's just good to have. Um, with hunting or defending yourself. Alright. Broken Railroad region. May have to bust out the trusty bedroll soon and take a little nap. My guy is pretty tired. I mean, I do have probably have enough firewood to have a fire long enough for me to sleep for a couple, couple hours. Rocks. Always rocks. I kind of wish running uh, warmed you up a bit. I mean, I know if you're like running in the wilderness and uh, you start sweating or whatever, it starts freezing you uh, even more. Judo kick! Um, but it'd be cool if it kind of warmed you up after walking for so long and like having bursts of burst of speed. I don't know where the heck I'm going anymore. Why do they have right here? I thought they'd never wake up again. Well, yeah, probably won't wake up again. So let's not fall asleep. I don't see any structures. Oh, back behind these mountains and <coughs> probably start a fire because my guy is not looking too good. No, no. Wait, why didn't that work? Shit. Shit. Excuse my language. Excuse my language. So close. I survived one day, discovered nine locations, 5% of the world. I expended 4,000 calories. I went 5.7 miles. I was awake for 17 hours, rested only nine. 19 hours were spent in the house, eight outdoors, one day in Mystery Lake. So, well, that's the long dark. Um, damn wolf, man. 
Uh, sorry about my language. I was in the heat of battle. Um, like, if uh, you want me to keep going with an episode 4, uh, subscribe. Let me know. Let me, just let me know how you're feeling. Uh, let me know if you want me to play a different game, different genre, different whatever. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, click on the links down below if you could. I'd really appreciate it. Support the Kickstarter for my company. Um, Patreon for the YouTube channel. Uh, if you have, if you have uh, no money to give, just uh, give me a like, give me a view. Uh, that's all that matters to me, is that I'm making content uh, that you want to see. So uh, I'll see you next time. Be good, and I'll talk to you all later.